the hobo. What you expect? It's the new hobo. This one, it's like a beautiful burgundy. You can't really see it, but it's beautiful. <laughs> Look at it. Look at the color. It's just, it's just amazing. Look at the color. It's just amazing. The color. There's my trademark. And if you can see it up close, mm, mm, mm. you can see the metal flakes in it. Mm. You can see the headstock. It's trimmed down very, very thin. So is the neck. You can see that. And the color is just beautiful. It's an active base, active five. We're going to go through it. All right. Follow me. All right. Here we go. Let's get this out of the way. Okay. All right, right now, I'm coming through a Harky, um, an A100, and it doesn't have a horn. It has a limiter on it, so it's probably going to be, you know, this bass is very, very high and very, very bottomy, very bottomy, and great mids. So, I got everything down. Um, I got the volume down very low. Um, I got the bass, you know, about probably at 8 o'clock. And I definitely got the trouble, definitely at 7, maybe 6.30. All right? So everything is off on the base, and the base has a boost switch also. I, oh, you, you're looking at the Tangelo? Yeah, yeah. That's the sister right here. Right here. All right, so let's check this out. Uh, everything is off on the base. The, the trouble is off. The base is off. The mids are off, and whatever you hear now is what the bass sounds naturally. Okay, let's turn it over here. Okay, that's a natural sounding bass, naturally sounding. Okay, rear pickup.
treble, 100%. Peace out.